welcome back to my channel in this video i will show how you can install ubuntu 22.04 lts on vmware workstation player in windows 11 so let's get started open vmware workstation player application you will find a link in video description how to download and install VMware Workstation Player in Windows 11. Let's create a new virtual machine. Now I am going to install Ubuntu 22.04 LTS from installer disk image file, ISO file. Browse the ISO file and then open and then click on next now enter the personalized Linux information and then enter username and also provide password and then enter the same password again click on next now i am going to enter the virtual machine name ubuntu 22.04 lts 64 bit okay and this is the default location where the newly created virtual machine will be stored. You can change this location by browsing the folder and then click on next. Now specify the disk capacity. You can increase this size. Okay, this is the recommended memory size for Ubuntu. 64 bit operating system select this option and then click on next virtual machine wizard is ready to create virtual machine but you can customize the hardware information select memory you can increase this memory size this is the ram size depending on your computers RAM size and then select processors enter the number of processor cores as much as possible depending on your computers processor and then click on close now click on finish to create the virtual machine and start installing Ubuntu. To direct input to this virtual machine press Ctrl plus G. That's it. Ubuntu is loading from ISO file. It may take a while for verifying the installation configuration. Select keyboard layout and then click on continue. Now choose the installation setup. The minimal installation is useful for those with smaller hard drives or who don't require as many pre-installed applications. In the other options, you will be promoted to download updates as well as third-party software that may improve device support and performance during the installation. I am going to select the first option, normal installation type. And then check this box to install third-party software for graphics and Wi-Fi hardware 
and additional media formats and then click on continue. It may take a while for preparing Ubuntu drivers. Now choose the installation type. If you would like Ubuntu to be the only operating system on your hard drive, select Erase Disk and Install Ubuntu. But if your device currently has another operating system installed, you choose the second option and here you can create or resize partitions yourself or choose multiple partitions for Ubuntu. I am going to select the first option, click on install now button. Now click on continue. Now choose the country or region, click on continue. Now enter your information here, enter your name, you can enter any name here. and pick up a username and also choose a password for this user name enter the same password again and then click on continue It will take a while for copying files. If you have an active internet connection, with your computer, it may take a while for downloading packages. You can skip this package downloading. That's it. Ubuntu 22.04 LTS installation is complete. You need to restart the computer in order to use the new installation. So. Click on Restart Now button. Now log into your Ubuntu user account. Click here and enter the password that you have provided for this user account. Hit enter. Finally, you can choose to switch your desktop from light to dark theme. And also, you can increase the resolution from here. Now I am going to install the updates and then enter the password. It may take a while for installing updates. If you are new to this channel, subscribe this channel and like, comment, share. Thank you so much for watching this video.